There are good things that we can do as a community to support our environment and this is just an example of that. All of the plants that we'll be putting in are native and most of them are to be considered locally native. We've got the native mat rushes and the native reeds. So we've got two rows of the mat rushes against the footpath and the intention of that is the mat rushes will have about a two metre root system underneath them when they're fully grown and they're binding into the original bank as well as the new soil that's been put in. And then the native reeds along the water's edge so they like a bit more closeness to the water, a bit more wet feet and they won't grow as densely. The most immediate need for this planting is to stabilise this soil that has been placed there. We're also um, uh, aware of the fact that the watersheds off the car park adjacent and off the footpath adjacent so we're expecting some water flows to be crossing through and flowing through into the creek from here. So we're wanting these plants to intercept that flow and potentially slow it down and intercept any sediment or debris that might come through so that it doesn't make its way into the creek itself. My expectation is that these plants will root down all the way through the soil and the rocks and the surface of the lunkers so that their root mass will be sitting underneath that in the water itself and that's a great substrate for a whole range of little algal microorganisms and growths to happen. I think that the introduction of some more of these larger native reeds and rushes will um, provide more habitat for the water birds to come out of the water and to be sort of feel safe and, and secure on the edge of the bank. Whether they nest in there, that'd be really interesting to find out down the track, whether the water birds are happy to start nesting in amongst these reed beds that we're putting in. These special places in the landscape need local support and local commitment and local love to keep them going. And we've been seeing a lot of that with the people coming down and talking to us throughout the project.